Kristen with the Rogers Public Library and this week for Catch em All at the library we will be focusing on Dratini. So in your craft packet you'll have your coloring page. You will also have a package of Model Magic and some blue paint. And we are going to make a little clay figurine of Dratini. And now I'll show you how. So to make our little Dratini, first we just need to open up the package and then just work the Model Magic a little bit so that it gets nice and stretchy and just ready to be used. And then there are several ways that you can make this. I'm going to show you one way. So I'm going to Pull off a little chunk, maybe about a third of it. I'm going to make a sleeping dratini. So with the rest of my clay, I'm just going to make a little snake kind of body. So to start, I'm going to roll the rest of our clay into mostly a ball and then just start lengthening it, rolling it between my palms to lengthen it. And then one end, I want to roll to be very small. So, you could also roll it on the table rather than in your hands, whichever way. And then we're just going to make this curl around itself. Like our little Dratini, it's just curled up into a little ball to sleep. So that's my body. Then I'm going to pinch off two small amounts to make the ears and just a little tiny piece to make the little white spot on his head. So I'll roll that into mostly a ball and then just squish it a little. And that will be that piece. The rest of it will roll up into a circle to make the head. And then we're just going to start pinching a little bit towards the front to make the little snout. So we'll just pinch it out a little bit and then we kind of want to flatten it back in a bit because it sticks out, this little snout sticks out a little bit but not a whole bunch. So we'll just kind of shape that up to make a little snout and the rest of his head. Once we have the snout how we like it, then we can go ahead and grab our little dot on his head and just stick that gently on there. And I'm going to set that down for a moment to make the ears. I'm going to start out with a little ball. And then I'm just going to press it with my thumb onto the table. And then I'm going to go ahead and pinch across the middle of the ear to make a little ridge. And then I'm going to place one finger on one edge to make the smaller part. And pinch to kind of push that in there together to make that smaller and this edge to be fatter. And I'm going to pinch along both sides so we have those three ridges. Two on the outside and one through the middle. And then we just kind of want to make a little V shape for the end of the ear here. Then gently peel it up from the table. We just kind of have to gently pick it up off the table. You may have to do a few more adjustments once it's up off the table or whatever surface you're working with. And then we can attach the little ear to the side of the head and just gently press it on and then you can reshape anything you feel like you need to reshape. And then 
we just need to make one more ear. Once we have both of his ears how we want them, and we're just going to add the head onto the body. We'll just gently press it on there. If you need to add any more shaping or adjust any more shaping, you can do that. And then our little sleepy Dratini figure is done. Now, we just need to let the clay dry, so you'll probably have to let it dry for a day or two. But then once, once it is dry, then you can take the blue paint from your packet and just go ahead and paint all around the top of the body and leave the bottom white. And then we're going to leave the ears white the little snout white and the little dot on top of his head white. But just paint the rest blue. And then once your paint is dry, you can draw on some little sleeping eyes. And then he's all done. Now you can see my two look different. And if I made it again, it would look different again. So don't worry if yours does not look like mine. You also don't have to do the sleeping pose if you want to make him so that he's more of a long snake dragging, kind of standing up with the head on top. You can do that too. You can draw awake eyes on him. So whatever you prefer really, but this is one way to make a very cute little Dratini figure. And that is our craft for this week. Thank you so much for joining me, and I will see you next time to make another Pokemon.